It's another day on the Mondeo, so welcome back to the channel. Okay guys, as you can see, I've got everything apart again, and what we're going to do today is we're going to work on this and we're going to try and finish up all the boxing and all the other little bits I want to do. Um, basically, where the boost pipes do actually clear this corner, and I've put some of this uh, red edging, um, I'm going to just cut this away a bit more and then reinforce it, um, cut the lip off and then move it back. Um, purely just to get myself some some space I mean they do fit but it's tight I don't want any rubbing so what I'm also going to do then where I've put this red edging here on this on the subframe there's a big lip that comes here and there's no welds or anything it's just a lip so I'm going to nibble away at that a little bit more um, and then reapply the edging and that should win me a load of space but uh, my main point today is to get this to a point where I can spray it um, and just get it on and get it finished and then hang on for the rest of my boost pipes to arrive so that should be soon but let's get to going right so here's a catch up now so i've boxed in these sections here just welded them on and i have cut out the side now i've decided i'm not going to weld the lip on here i'm just going to clean it up and i'm going to use a bit of that um that edging stuff that i had that side's the same and then in the car you can see where I've just painted over the top of that. I've zapped that down, sure, a good probably about 10 mil. And then this side too, I've done the same. Just zapped it down, as you can see. I mean, that that was straight, so I've zapped it down and then down more there. But yeah, things, things are looking good. Okay, time for another catch up. And I've pretty much finished. So, got those all ground out and I've thrown a coat of paint on it um, probably can't see it in the sunshine but uh, you can see a bit better there but yeah that is it done now so I am happy with that need to wait for this to dry so it's probably tomorrow get it back in the car intercooler back on and then do the piping so to catch up here we are um, as you can see it's all ready together for a quick test drive so basically I got all the part work done, uh, you can't really see it, but there is the MAF holder, which is now away from everything, it should be, should be fine, so it's not catching anything, all the boost pipes are all on, um, obviously I, I straight revved it, just checked if I could see any leaks or anything, but I can't tell you anything, so that's why I need to take it for a drive before I put the bumper back on, um, but I had to space out the washer bottle a little bit here, you can see that but I had to space it out with some reasonably thick space it's probably about two centimeters so I used a longer bolt as you can see it's sitting slightly sideways um, the top mounts were fine the bottom one had to space out because it was pushing on uh, the boost pipe here and kinking it so I didn't really like that so I spaced it out it's still kind of touching a little bit um, there's probably about a mil of the space in there I don't know you can see but uh, yeah so I've got the wheels on Got it all on together, got the lights on. Um, I'm gonna run up and down, just make sure that it is holding boost and it's not leaking anywhere. And then start modifying the grill because I wanna utilize this now, these new holes, these new air holes I've got. So I'm gonna probably draw some holes in the, the grill or something. I don't know, I'm not 100% sure yet. But uh, let's at least get this test done. So I've been for a drive, it's all holding boost, everything seems fine. Um, there are a couple little bits I want to tidy up, a couple parts don't line up quite right on the cold side, but intercooler is going well. So I'm going to call this one here, uh, purely because I'm running out of time, um, but we need to get the bumper on next time, cut some more holes in it for more ventilation for the top of the intercooler, and um, yeah, send it to the moon. So um, again, thanks for joining me in this, and uh, like, share, subscribe, you know the deal, and I'll see you next time.